Going on my people, man. We're back here with another video, man. We'll be doing the WWE 2K Showcase. This is the story mode. They finally brought it back. I think the last one was 2012. I'm going to go ahead and skip this, but let's go ahead. I've and never go. had it easy in WWE. I've had injuries. I was released twice, and just when I had scratched and clawed my way to the top, my in-ring career was over. I could have sat at home, satisfied with what I accomplished, but I decided that's not how I wanted my story to end. I wanted to show myself, my family, and anyone who's gone through adversity in life that you need to take on whatever challenges you face and fight for your dreams. Well, we might as well get on the Daniel Bryan bandwagon. Turn of Daniel Bryan. All right. <clears throat> what is John Cena? So I'm gonna right try to make these short and simple. High school, I moved from Washington down to Texas to train at Shawn Michaels School. It wasn't too long after that that I was signed by WWE. When I first got signed by WWE in 2000, I had no idea really what to expect. 2000? Most of the guys on TV had been wrestling for years and years, and at that point I'd only been wrestling for six months. Since I was still really new to all this, I was sent to hone my craft at WWE's developmental territory, which at the time was in Memphis. Luckily, William Regal was a trainer there and he helped me out a lot. So with the WWE contract and Hall of Fame trainers, Brian Danielson was on the fast track to success, right? No, not quite. I was released in 2001, the first time I was released by WWE. It was really hard actually because I really didn't know what to do. William Regal told me this is a chance to learn. This is a chance to go travel the world, find who you are as a wrestler and find who you are as a person. Daniel so I went Bryson. back to the Indies and touring in Japan. <clears throat> but soon after that, in 2003, Brian Danielson made his triumphant return to WWE. Well, sort of. Brian Danielson from Aberdeen, Washington. I returned for some one-off matches on WWE's weekend shows, Sunday Night Heat and Velocity. I like this too. Look at that. Nice monkey flip. Well, you know, this Brian Danielson is a very accomplished young man. We've seen him in the past, and he's very, very good. I didn't really have a goal other than it was good exposure on TV. And one of these matches happened to be against a young up-and-comer named John Cena. Damn. Surely this would be my big break, right? This had to be 2004, 2005. That's been 2003, I think. All right, let's go uh, for uh, this. Perform a light limb attack. All right. Oh, I think this man. I don't even know how to do all this shit. Welcome everybody to WWE Velocity. Michael Cole here alongside Corey Graves and Byron Saxton. We kick things off with John Cena against oh. a local competitor named Brian Danielson. Say, okay, that's gonna be a problem. I had a problem with that last time in one of my videos. Because John Cena I can't. is focused. He's facing Brock Lesnar. Yeah, I'm not He's got him covered. Gonna take more than that. Know. Executed perfectly. How you do a lemon sack? That's the question. Let me see. On the arm. No, that's how you. Okay, that's how you do that shit. This is a level of destruct cover here. It's Honestly, I don't know what the fuck's gonna be going on. I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing. Period. That's my first actual match match. I have not did any gameplay at all. Don't boo me. Looks to be focusing on the arm now. I think Cena is a little surprised by the offense of this relative unknown. Cena's new attitude may have made him overlook Danielson, but if he refocuses, he should easily take control back here. Like UFC a little bit. Damn. Wow, he got I out of it. Yeah, now. I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. All right. 
Oh, pick him up, go for the head. Wow, what a vertical suplex. I reverse it. Oh, the Shit. Reversal by John Cena. I don't know John how to reverse it. I'm sorry. Prototype of a WWE superstar. He's got the physique and athleticism. Get up, of Daniel. A Come on. WWE champion. I completely agree, Byron. We've already seen ah. some man of talent like Chris Jericho and Rikishi in singles action. The human body I thought Chris was time. Now it's popping up. So much of that. Not today. The two of you were spot on about John Cena's potential. Cena's a blue chip. He's a high fly too. Oh! He's taking notes tonight. Oh boy, he is warm. Do it on the head now. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Oh, in the rain. Wow, fuck you, 2K. Right here. I'm seeing Jade the Razor Ramon on Raw in 1993, guys. A high flying nobody is about to beat one of the ah. WWE's best. Cena is too distracted by Brock Lesnar on the horizon. He's got to focus on surviving this Come match. On. John Cena's yeah, stock has really risen lately, so it's no surprise that he's now challenging the Royal Rumble. Oh, on the ground. Lesner, I read this shit completely wrong. I'm fucking illiterate. Quite an impact on his debut. When Vince McMahon implored the. All right. Submission time. He's losing his grip, Michael. Damn. And he somehow fights his way free. Lucky for him. That I did this shit. Going back to Cena's ruthless aggression. One. Submission time. Interesting decision here. Coming grapple at the head. I don't know. Okay. So they won't get that limb attack shit. Right back my bad, y'all. I'm strategy. retarded. You weaken the poor, powerful Cena by taking away one of his arms. Ryan sticking to his wheelhouse, not taking any unnecessary risks here against John Cena. Oh, just looking to control and neutralize the bigger man. Cena, though, back to his feet, and Brian continues to work on the arm, but now Cena has the strength, and you don't want to get into a power battle with John. Absolutely not. Cover here. And a kick out. What? And again, Cena powering Danielson down. Oh! Oh, oh yeah! Oh! Hey, man. Hey, hey! Hey, pause, bro. Gonna try it again, and Danielson able to come out. Thanks. Send Cena flying. Incredible sequence. Oh, man, Cena just took Danielson's head off. We say that sometimes there's no replacement for brute force. Whooping his ass. Get the fuck up. He always had great stamina. See if it lasts here. I can't reverse. Taken out by the Russian leg sweep. We're seeing that trademark ruthless aggression from John Cena, and it's overwhelming Danielson. Danielson isn't used to the big stage. Ah! Cena's got this all wrapped up. Wow, really? You must pay extra close attention. Cena's in trouble now. This is gonna frustrate John Cena. Cena's now showing signs of fatigue. Uh. Now in full control. John Cena being pressed hard. Oh no, nope. John Cena got outclassed. Nah, B. Mm hmm. And look at the How the fuck Cena. did you miss that? Keep Chairs your back eye in the ring. He fucked up. Whoa. He fucked up, bitch. I'm gonna kick the shot of his ass. I don't know what his super is. Look at this. This one's over, guys. Well, John Cena's in a real, clearly on a mission here. That should do it. Ah, uh, he got it. Perform a strong attack at John Cena's head while he's oh, he slips out. Wow, looked to me like he had it locked in pretty good. I guess not. This oh. is the Cena that's just about unstoppable. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Oh, what an uppercut, Jordan. That it? I want to see the cutscene specifically. I don't know yeah, what the fuck to do. A different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. There we go. Okay. There we go. Kicking the shut in, dumbass. Can he score the pin? Never 
say that ah. attitude out of him. Into the corner, okay. I thought for sure that This was seems it. very similar to the showcase back in like 2K12, and I think 2K14 was the last Daniels one. Did. What with do you the do on the cover. As he whips Cena across the ring. Ooh. Oh, Cena gets up a boot just in time. And now John Cena looking to take over. Looking up, put oh. Brian Danielson where he wants him. And here's the cover. Oh, he fuck no. Cena with the win over Brian Danielson. Here is your winner. Really? Did all that get an ass whooping? I guess. Got to be impressed with Cena tonight. Let's go ahead and exit. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. We got John Cena 03. That's what's up, man. So hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. See you later, man.